The games that we have for you today, it's, it's, it's a couple of mini games, but all right. it all is based on you end every set by saying, I've been Kevin Hart. Thanks a lot. I'm Kevin Hart. You guys are great. Why do you do that? I used to bomb so much that <laughs> I would be annoyed with the crowd, and I'm like, I'm Kevin Hart. Like, just as like a, fuck you. Mm. I'm not even going to tell you my real name. You don't care. It doesn't matter. And uh, it was kind of to see if they were even still listening. Right. Because they hated me so much. It just stuck. There's a lot of tourists in New York who go to these shows, like from fucking Scandinavia and all these places. And uh, they'll be like, that was Kevin Hart. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I picture some guy in Norway going back to Norway and be like, we saw Kevin Hart. He was a short or a skinny white guy. Not good. <laughs> he bombed. You know. <laughs> I can't do accents. Obviously. I'm like, <laughs> well, Mark, we're glad you're here. Hey, yeah. good to be here. Game. Are you Kevin Hart? Man, how about that lineup last night? It was like oh. Soder, Hannibal, uh, Fahim. Uh, yeah, Feeney. Yeah, Feeney. It was a banger. Yeah, I mean, it's that, that. that's what's nice about the Mothership now. It's like every, just uh, randomly, it'll just be just a crazy banger of a lineup of yeah. everyone, everyone who's visiting. Yeah. So cool. It's so fun. Like everyone just visits at once here. Right, right. Like it's so it's like it's like, oh wow, this is like it's really cool. It's I I almost feel like I'm in both LA and New York all the time. Oh, yeah, that's a good yeah. way to put it. Mm -hmm. Right, that's really right. Because cool. mm -hmm. I see everybody constantly. Yeah, you got Sam Morell's here, then Joe List is here, yep. then uh, Hannibal's here. Yeah, it's it's crazy. Yeah, well literally like all the New York guys, they went back to back to back to back. It went like, yeah, it went. List was here, Marula's here, and then you and Soder came, yeah. and it's like, oh wow, this is crazy. Yeah, right. Yeah, and then you always have the hovering Shane Gillis. Mm -hmm. yeah. He's always he's, there. Yeah, Shane Gillis is everywhere at once. Yeah, <laughs> he yeah, feels yeah. like he's, he's kind of like God. He's like, what? I know. <laughs> he's, he's doing Radio City, but then I see him talking to Steph Curry. I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. How do you do it? And then he's at the creek. Yeah, maybe we're just watching different retarded people. He's just parent trapping us with a bunch of different different all. Guys, it's like what? Exactly. <laughs> it's kind of like Brad Williams and Wee Wee Man had that. You know, do you know Wee Man? Yeah. He was the guy on Jackass the Midget. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I was just like, oh, that, that's Brad Williams. He can skate. Oh, that's Wee Man. Oh, there he's on Game of Thrones. Oh, that's Dinklage. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> people say black people look alike. I'm like, no, midgets. midgets. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All very similar. <laughs> They, we, we the other day on Sixth Street they had they have midget wrestling here. Yeah. What? Pretty that was fucking awesome. Oh, man. dude, the mini rumble. Woo! We stopped in between sets. So in between sets, literally in between two different sets, mm. stop by and just watch a little midget wrestling. Yeah. Whoa. I mean, what's gonna pump you up? Yeah. Like, right. just like, yeah. Oh, that's man. comedy. Yeah. Holy I was shit. Like, I gotta be funny. I gotta write more. I'm yeah. watching it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I gotta be more creative. Yeah. They're still yeah. in the room. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, <bro. laughs> wow. Damn, midget, mini midget wrestling. Yeah, yeah. No, no, it's straight up called it midget like, wrestling. Oh, right. okay. yeah, 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 it was sold out. Like, sold out. Wow. We were watching from outside the bar. Mm -hmm. like, Damn. Just outside the bar no, people were, like, business. climbing on top of the bar to get, like, a better look. It was insane. It I was love it. So many hot women. Come on. Mm -hmm. hot, and I mean, like, kill him! Really? Yeah, rip his little dick off! <laughs> <laughs> like, crazy, well, Brad Williams said he was, like, a fetish. Girls yeah. would be into him just because he was a midget. They're like, I got to do a bucket list. It was, yeah, and then to see, like, a shredded, because remember the one dude was, like, he was a little midget, but he was shredded. He was ripped. Really? Yeah, right, ripped. right, right. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like, man, I do think that would be a fetish. Yeah. yeah. Would you have sex with a midget woman, lady? I probably would, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. She, absolutely. She was pretty, I would do it. I mean, I don't even know if she was pretty, if I'm being honest. Yeah, it's like, it is like a bucket list type thing. Yeah, and you get the stand-up BJ. <laughs> How often yeah. can a gal blow you standing? The elusive stand up BJ. It's like it's like a it's like a achievement in a video game. You like a little thing pops up. <laughs> like, oh shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Midger files, dude. But oh, you wouldn't. Yeah. The thing about the movement, you could pick her up, you could flip her around, mm -hmm. you could hold on to her. <laughs> the legs would never hit the ground. <laughs> yeah, that is true. She never would hit the ground. Yeah. yeah. That, that, is, that is crazy to have sex and your feet can do like this. Yeah, like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah right. <laughs> Oh god damn, Val, we good? Uh, but yeah, thank God we wait. We didn't. We we do have a game for you. I'm Great. Really excited. So. Yeah, man. Bring yeah, it yeah, on. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Are you competitive? Do you like games? Are you a game guy? I like World I games? like trivia. I like games. Yeah, mm. I like game shows. I'm a big Family Feud nut. Really? Oh, I love Family Feud. I don't know what it. It's kind of like comedy because they'll be like the the fast money, you know, at the mm -hmm. end, like yeah. the number one answer. Mm. It's like what's the this? We'll give you the setup, and you come up with the best punchline. Or whatever, Ooh. you know. They'll be like, "What's the, what a, 
what do you uh, what do you serve on Thanksgiving? So you're like, all right, turkey's one. Right. It's kind of like writing. I don't know. I, I feel a like similarity to Family Feud and and stand up. Interesting. Yeah, I've never really watched it like that. Really? Have you, ever, you ever like? I've never sat down and watched a full episode. I've just seen Steve Harvey clips. Oh, so wow. I know, oh no, it's great. I know how no, funny he is, but when you're saying that, like, oh wow, yeah, there's a, there's a writing aspect in your yeah. brain. It's a good game. It's a good game. Are you okay? You're on Family Feud. Do you and you win the buzzer? Player pass. Uh, I think you gotta play. I feel like the because if you pass, they got six people over there, or five people over there who all they need is one answer. Right. So I would just try to knock it out. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Because it's like if we don't get that answer, then they probably won't get that last answer, right? Because it's usually like a really one towards the bottom. Yeah. That doesn't, yeah. yeah. Exactly. And, it, and it's like, you ever played Quiplash? I was about to say, mm-hmm. that's my favorite game. No, what's that? Okay, so that's that's like a party game you can play with people. And it's like, you're all on your phone, and it's like, it gives you a prompt on your phone, and you have to answer as funnily as you can. Mm. You get two prompts, and then at the end, it throws them all up, and you guys vote on which ah. one's funnier. It's hilarious. And you don't know who said what, so you're just voting on literally like, oh, oh that's the wow. funniest, that's the that's funniest great. answer. That's great. Yeah, that's oh, a, gr- that's a great best, game. Right. Like it's, uh, and I, it's like a, th- a thread. Oh, like you do it with friends? No, you do it with friends, it's, yeah. it's like a live game. But so it's, it's like, okay. we'll get together, you can play eight at a time. Yeah. Whoa. It's like one of those. Bro, with comics, it's just like when you're playing with the boys, that, that is one of the most fun games of all time. That's a good right. way to get your juices flowing, oh, too. Oh, man. Mm. And then it's humbling, too, because you'll lose. Yeah, You're like, everyone will vote for the one that wasn't yours. You know it was you. Yeah. And you just for sure, like, damn, you also are like, Damn, I would vote for the other one too. Yeah, it's better. <laughs> so I like it like that. It's very like, oh, you can bomb. You yeah, know? it's kind of like Twitter is a game. Who's yes. gonna have the best joke about Biden or and, whatever? And like right now, you got you like you like thirty seconds. So it's also I like that. I like the it's it's the pressure. It's, it's immediate, and it's like I would be the reason to bring the anti family feud because really feud is that one the three point round. That's kind of the whole thing. I got it. Got you it. You know what I mean? So there's one round in Quiplash that's really the game. Yeah, yeah. the first round's almost like a warm up. I and see. then that big round is the game. Right. That's how I feel about feud. It's the same way as that. Okay. All right. I'm gonna get on this quiplash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look it up. It's it's like a great like hanging out with friends game, especially Man, if like all comics. Yeah. There's a couple good games for like an all comics game night. That uh, what's uh, code names? That's another one. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Because like some of the things are just like you can just say because you don't know, but so it'll just be like. The N word like four times, but that, <laughs> but that is the funniest. Yeah, yeah. But you don't know who said it. You know, yeah. oh, that's hilarious. That's you're hilarious. truly playing. Like, yeah, oh yeah. man, yeah, bro. Yeah, that's like, great. Like, like one of my favorite answers ever it was a. Uh, I don't even remember what the, the prompt was, but it was like Kobe and Gigi's helicopter adventure. Oh. <laughs> and everyone was like, it was. The and, best. It was just a, and it was just a callback for the entire yeah, like, night. Oh, so it's like, God. Yeah. it's a game like that where you're okay. like, oh man, truly the funniest answer wins. I yeah. love it. I love it. But you're playing in the same room. Room? Yeah. yeah. Do you get to go? That was mine. Come on. Well, it, it tells you at the end after oh, okay. after the voting's done. Got it. So got you, it. Yeah. so yeah. So you'll you'll get to know eventually, but like that way it doesn't influence who you vote for. Got it. You know, so it's just like what is the straight up funniest. Yeah. yeah. That's I like that. Great. I like that because then you can play with. I like the idea of you can play with like famous people. Yeah. Because you're truly, it's like oh, it takes the ego out yeah. of it. Like, yeah. Yeah. Exactly. You, you yeah. Know, you're voting for. Like I'd love to play that with like people with huge like a Tom Brady, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And, like Nicki Minaj, like, yeah, you know, like yeah. you know, who said the funniest thing? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, um. <laughs> all right, Val, 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 are we good? Are we ready? Yeah, are we not audio? Uh, okay, okay, yeah. Hell, yeah, hell yeah. Hopefully the midget thing stays in. Well, fingers Ooh. crossed. No, yeah, yeah right. Yeah, yeah. We're putting it in. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we're putting it in, even if it's silent. Even if it's silent, it's too funny. All right. Uh, so ahead, buddy. the games that we have for you today is it's it's a couple of mini games, but all right. it all is based on you end every set by saying I've been Kevin Hart. Yes. Yes. Uh, we asked. We also we don't know you very well. Why do you do that? I'm just curious. Start. How did it start? What's all that about? I used to bomb so much that <laughs> I would be annoyed with the crowd, and I'm like, I'm Kevin Hart. Like just as like a fuck you. <laughs> I'm not even gonna tell you my real name. You don't care. It doesn't matter. And uh, it was kind of to see if they were even still listening because right. they hated me so much. So I would just throw that out there as like a curveball at the end, and then it stuck. And then people were like, "Oh, that's kind of funny." And I was like, "Maybe I'll do it on the Tonight Show." <laughs> I did it on the Tonight Show, and I did on my special, my Netflix special, my YouTube special. So it just stuck. Damn. Now I see open micers doing it. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I've seen people do it. I've seen. I've seen you start. Your uh, your cadence and that to double down. Oh, <laughs> sorry, you got to hear more of that. That's brutal. Yeah, I, there's a lot of clones. I see a lot of Gillis hand behind the back. Mm-hmm. Oh, there. Uh, a lot of 
A lot of that. This, yeah. this is huge. We see, we see comics in Austin do that one this all the time. Man. So a lot oh of Bill God. Burr. Da, da, mm -hmm. This that chop thing. Yeah. Yeah. There's a lot of clones. A lot yeah. of tell. I was I was also yeah, a lot of tell. I was also listening to uh, this is the first time I really got to watch Soder do an hour, mm -hmm. and I was like, oh wow, a lot of people have this cadence. Like a lot uh -huh. of people, a lot of people have like he is like the ba he is like a, such a great cadence that a lot yeah. of people have built off of that. Yeah, that's true. I he, can you can really see it. He's got that deep voice though, mm -hmm. so you yeah. can't. Re recreate that like he no, does. No, no, he is the master of his. Yeah, that is. But the way he uses his voice and like pauses and stuff. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. I, I see people pause and like. I, the, yeah, the it's like, and, like I can. I, right, I, right, I can. Yeah. I can tell if someone has like opened for him now. Oh yeah. Yeah, because exactly. he's like he's like you can tell like oh that cadence is so influential to everyone who's open to him. Yeah, that's what it feels like anyways. Oh yeah. At least no. at least at least looking looking from the outside in. Hundred mm -hmm. percent. But yeah, you got to have your own thing. You right. Gotta make your thing, even if it's weird. Just lean into it. Right. When you would say, uh, you know, that's my time about Kevin Hart. Would it get a laugh in the beginning? Like even when you first started saying, would it get a chuckle or anything? No, but I had. There's a lot of tourists in New York who go to these shows, like from fucking Scandinavia mm -hmm. and all these places, and uh, they'll be like. That was Kevin Hart. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I picture some guy in Norway going back to Norway and be like, "We saw Kevin Hart. He was a short or a skinny white guy, not good. <laughs> he bombed. You know, <laughs> I can't do accents. Obviously, I'm like, oh man, I'm in Norway. <laughs> oh shit, dude, that Jamaican Norwegian was crazy. <laughs> yeah. that was crazy Jamaican Norwegian. Yeah. Well, Mark, we're glad you're here. Hey, good yeah. to be For our here. Game, are you Kevin Hart? Hart. Oh, <laughs> shit. Is this nigga Kevin Hart? <laughs> Is that nigga him? Right. Uh, I'm in white face. <laughs> we, have, we have three games for you. Three All little right. mini games. Finally decide if you actually are Kevin Hart. Ooh. Yeah. The first one is a variation on the Wikipedia game where we have... People go well. People, it's a, it's the game that people play is called Six Degrees to Kevin Bacon. Yes, where you know they try you to get what? to Kevin Bacon in six steps. Oh, we yeah. are going to give you three random Wikipedia articles and try to get to Kevin Hart. The first oh, one, we'll okay. give you like ten degrees to Kevin yeah, Hart. Right. Kevin, the All first right. one, it will get increasingly harder. First one, you do by yourself. Second one, Derek will help you. Third one, it's a team effort. All right, thank you. All right, yeah. All so, right. all right, let's go. The first, per the first person. No, that's the. <laughs> well. Harvey oh, Weinstein. Damn. <laughs> can you get to Kevin Hart from Harvey Weinstein? I'm sure we can do this. Yeah, tell, yeah and Val will tell you, but you just tell Val what you need her to do, and she, she will go there. Okay, okay. Oh, am I allowed to look at this? Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, take right. time, yeah. Take your time. It's the game. Yeah, this oh, geez. Okay. Well, let's see. Oh, God. I like, I like how rape is uh, highlighted. Like, in case we need to know what rape is, we got to click on that. Uh, <laughs> Just as a link? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it just sends you to Cosby's tour date. Yeah. Um, oh, God damn. Okay, well, let's see. Yeah, me too. I mean. Yeah, he was born in Queens. Mm. Okay. Mm. There's, the, there's still more. You can also use more of the page, too. Okay. You know, it doesn't have to be at the top. All right, all right. Uh, <laughs> that's not going to help me. No, um, I think I'd, <laughs> Queens would be crazy. Uh, okay, all right, all right. Go back up. Sorry. I'm going to try to do this quick. I don't want to bore anybody. No, here. you're no, good. You're no, we're, no we're, right. we're, we're watching this. And anything all you right. see, please uh, keep, keep <laughs> 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 yeah. your comments. Okay. Okay. <laughs> we, we, we could go down the rape rabbit hole if we really need to. <laughs> you can use that link. You got, you got, you got 10 links. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Okay, well, I think Harvey did Miramax. Miramax mm -hmm. produced one of Chris Rock's movies. All right. Okay. So let's see. The control F. Control F. Miramax. Miramax. Right, 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 oh, there Miramax. it is. Okay. So we're at one. Is that too much of a leap? No. Well, I, 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 think, think, I think you're gonna mean because now think, you're in movies. Now All you're right. in movies. Okay. All right. Well, he also did Pulp Fiction, which has Bruce Willis in it. Were they both in Pets? Go to Pulp Fiction. There it is. All right. Okay. We got two. We got two. All right to the left. Right, right here. There, man. Yeah. Pulp Fiction. Wow. All right, and now we want to go Bruce, Bruce Willis. Willis or Samuel L. Jackson, or maybe Samuel or Jackson. Ving Rhames. We got a lot here. Yeah, this this is this is damn. All right, all right, because he's in a bunch of movies. Right. He's in a movie with Brian Cranston. Mm -hmm. So we could probably connect that somehow. Is Cranston in a Tarantino? I don't think so. Damn. All right. I don't think so. Is he's in a Cranston movie in movies like that? Really? He's in a movie where he's in Jumanji. He's in. Uh, what else is he in? Let's see. All no, right, I'm, I got this. I'm, 
John Trav- There's got to be some movies with Chris Rock. I'm going to say this. Is not is Cranston in a heart movie? Cranston is in a heart yeah, movie. Yeah, the, the wheelchair. The wheelchair. Yeah. Right, right. He got shit for that, for being uh, playing a disabled person when not being disabled. Right. Which is exactly what acting is. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I never understood that one. Are you- <laughs> <laughs> that, that is that is because I used to talk about that because the logical extension of that is like, how come there aren't real pedophiles on Law and Order SVU? Yeah, there you go. Right, that's the logical. Like eventually, yes. like where where is the line? Where does it end? Where is the line? When do we? When we raise the stakes on that show? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 so yeah, long. right. Do <laughs> <laughs> we have to get real murderers, real serial killers, yeah. real gangbangers? Yeah, what are we doing here? Where does it end? Okay, sorry. Here, I would sorry. go down exactly. Like, help my go down to the uh, the cast. That way, yes, now you can, yes, you know yes. yeah. Now you can really. Uh, okay. There we go. Okay, okay. So let's see what we got here. You got a lot of big actors, so it's like those are for sure we can. Yeah. Um, now I gotta think of what Kevin Hart is in and who's he in it with. He's in Jumanji. He's in. The Brian you got Cranston, Jack Black. You got Jumanji. Oh. You got The Rock. You got uh, some lady. Yeah, lady. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, lady who's in all the Marvel movies. Mm, no, but I think I see. So I think I see. Connected. I think I see a connection here. Uh oh. All right. All right. I got this. I think okay. I see it here. I think I. I think I actually see one. Well, you got lifelines. We'll make them up as you go. All right. All right. I'll go with uh, Tarantino directed Jackie Brown. Jackie Brown had Chris Tucker. Ooh. Chris Tucker is in, geez, he's in Money Talks. He's in Rush Hour. I scroll up uh, now to Jack uh, to Tarantino. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. Director, all the way, yeah, all the way up. up. All the way yeah. Up. So Tarantino, yeah. directed by Tarantino. Yeah, we're at three. Okay, he did Jackie Brown, which is right there on the bottom of the second paragraph. Yeah, right here. So we're at, right here. So we're at four. All right. Okay. Scroll down the cast, and we got Chris. You said you, you Chris, got Chris Tucker. Tucker. He is in there. Yeah. Now we're getting close. Yeah. Now I'm just putting. I'm going racist here. <laughs> He's like, These blacks <laughs> must know each other. <laughs> they must all do things together. Uh, they were both on Def Jam, but I don't know. If, I think Kevin Hart's too young for Def Jam. Huh. Okay. Hold on. Okay. Friday. As I see. Ice Cube. Cube. Oh. We're yeah. getting, oh, you found it. Yeah, you, found, no, it. you, found, it. you found, found it. You found it. Found it. Oh, Come on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, what's that fucking movie called? Damn it. Oh, well, well, let's go. Go, 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 let's go, let's go, go Friday. Friday. Friday, Ice Cube. And then hit Ice Cube. Right at the top. Uh, there. there it is. Oh, this is a great game. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Now, he's in that movie. Is it, it, now, now we have to go from here. Is it Ride Along? Is oh, it, there it is. There it is. Was that? that was, I think, seven. Oh, seven. All right. Right. We made it. I think the, the other the other route I saw was Samuel L. Jackson, other guys rock. Oh, oh the other guys rock. Oh, right. that's right. good. Uh, yeah, that that's was good. That, that was a good one. You gotta right. go black. You gotta, <laughs> you gotta, you gotta go. follow the black bread <laughs> crust. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta do it. All right. All right. Our intermediate one. Prince Andrew. <laughs> oh damn. Yeah. To Kevin Hart. To Kevin Hart. Okay, okay, well, he, Kevin Hart's the size of a kid. <laughs> <laughs> I know he likes them young. All right. Uh, okay. Oh, this is going to be tough. Well, mm. again, I might go to Meghan Markle. Ooh. Is she Ooh. part of the family? Is she part of the family? Uh, well, you, you can, we can control F, see if Meghan Markle is in here. Oh really? Yeah, my, my this as well. is the Indian in you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, is all, this is how you this is how you play <laughs> yeah. Wikipedia games, son. Yeah. <laughs> but Control F is your friend. Uh, no. no, there's no Meghan oh, Markle. Oh no, Markle. No Markle. If oh, we're all the way shit. down here. Okay. Yeah, Us, it's, her name is spelled different. Yeah, that's uh-huh. his wife, though, right? No, no, no Meghan no, Markle. That's is. Prince Harry's wife. Yeah. Can Who's, we get the Prince Harry from Prince Andrew? Yes. Oh, absolutely. Good point. Let's get the Prince Harry. Jeez, let's go to Prince Harry. Thank you, sir. Good call. Because in my head, I'm like, all right, they did that interview with Oprah. I'm doing the black. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so yeah. Like, yeah. Yes, <laughs> we got to yes. get some, we're gonna all roads to Oprah. Yeah. <laughs> is that right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, she's yeah. not in this game. So you can't use her. All right, so is it Prince Harry? Is that his brother? Prince Harry's his ne- nephew, nephew, I believe. But he was at the he was at the Epstein Island. Yeah, he no, was, yeah. Uh, Andrew, Andrew is famously at Epstein Island. Yeah, I think you got to control F Harry again. Let's see. So that's his nephew. Yeah. So Prince Harry is. There, there it is. is. 
Prince yes, he Harry. married you. Wow. That's Meghan Markle. Prince Harry's married. This motherfucker. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now you know. Fucking, right. that, yeah, yeah, fucking Andy Dalton and it, Carson Wentz and yeah, everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he does look like Carson Wentz. Oprah with Meghan, Meghan and Harry. There you <laughs> go. Now we're on Oprah. Now we're on Oprah. And I'm sure Kevin Hart was on Oprah yeah. at some point. He has to be. So you want to go to Oprah right here? Is that what we yeah, want to do next? Oprah, All right, Oprah so we're, we're Prince Harry to Oprah Winfrey. Yeah. All right, that's two. All right, now where do we go from here? I think Kevin Hart was on the show. All right, so go to Oprah Winfrey we'll show. Go to Oprah Winfrey show. Because if not, we'll definitely find a guest that was. We'll, we'll yeah, get exactly. ice cream again. Yeah, so that's exactly. three. <laughs> oh, but like it has like look at look at the number of episodes. Can we even look it up? I think if you Google was well, we Kevin can't, Hart, we can't Google it. We got to stay on Wikipedia. Oh, okay, yeah, gotta okay. Okay. We got to stay on Wikipedia. So scroll, scroll down, Val. Scroll down a little bit. All right. Oh, scroll up, scroll up, scroll up, Val. All right, we got the color purple. We could go color purple and then Whoopi Goldberg. Now we're at a black comic. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Well, has he been on the View? No, Kevin I, Hart. I, I think. I think. Well, what we're seeing here is that you you can't search up the number of episodes, so I don't think they'll have right each. There's, so I think I think we should stay away from that line of thought. Okay. Okay. Yeah. There's mm -hmm. too many Oprah. There's episodes. too many Oprahs. All right. Gosh, you did 25 seasons. Wow. Mm, it, we could go Academy Award, and there, do you think they have a section of his hosting situation? I mean, if he ho didn't he not host? He, he did not, not host. host. But, but do would you, they have that in do, there? Would they? Because sometimes they have like controversy sections on That's true. these pages. Yo, I, you know what? I, I can we, you want to do it? Yeah. I think, I, let's go to Academy Award. Let's go Academy Award. That's so. <laughs> and then scroll down, Val. I bet you there's a controversy. Con criticism and controversies. Yep. Ooh, man, you guys okay. are good. <laughs> okay. <we're laughs> uh, let's see. We might be here a minute. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's a section about you. Yeah. <laughs> I put one of the statues up my ass. <laughs> yeah, they got me. Keep scrolling down a little bit. Oh, uh, the Dark Knight. That's what I call Kevin Hart. <laughs> <All right. laughs> okay. Uh, Damn. Michelle Yo, Yellow Face. Uh, <laughs> wait, wait, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> That's crazy. Oscars have been given to Yellow Face portrayals? Yeah. And they don't, oh, the Whoa, Mickey Rooney. Mickey That's Rooney. The, oh. <laughs> he, got an act, he got an Oscar for that? That's amazing. Oh, yeah. Okay, oh. we got Brad Pitt. We got uh, Weinstein. Symbol, symbolization. It's interesting that they don't. Yeah, because he never got to host. So yeah. maybe they're not counting it. Well, keep, uh, keep scrolling down there, there Val. That's so interesting, that, but that was such a huge thing, the slapping oh, incident. Slap, I mean, you got the of course. Slap. But oh, we're at Chris Rock. We're oh, at Chris Rock. And they did a documentary together on Netflix. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. I, think, I think we got it. Let's go, go, go Chris, Chris Rock. Rock. Go to Chris Rock. Right here. And then, let's see. Go, I would imagine it's under his filmography. Yeah, go to filmography. Yeah. It's going to be the latest thing. Yeah, go down. Oh, yeah, go down. Oh, damn. God, look at that. Go up, go up. One, two, three. So you might need to actually click on go up a little bit. His actual filmography. Mm. Damn, dude. Look at the first of all. Oh, my God. Oh, He's my working. God, oh, my God. <laughs> I mean, B-movie is just one of the things. <laughs> <that's going> on. <laughs> it's just one thing that he's yeah, done. Yeah, keep going. Keep going. Jesus. Keep going. This, is imp this is so he's impressive. Worked. Oh, television. Here we go. That oh. was just movies. This is wow. television. Oh, my God. Is it selective oh, outrage? It's not no, on no, there. no, 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 no. What the fuck? Why wouldn't you put that up? Maybe it's a Kevin Hart presents. Maybe yeah. it's a Kevin Hart production. Executive producer. That's very possible. Damn. Damn, we're already seven in. We really okay. So okay, okay. Let's think about it. Rats. We have three more guesses here. Isn't Kevin Hart? No, he's not in that. He doesn't like. He's not in the backstage high fiving him before let's, it starts. Let's go, go down. Maybe there's like more. Maybe there's like. Kevin can wait. That's so funny. They both done SNL. They have both done SNL. But we we don't know if we can get yeah. there easily. That's Real true. husbands of Hollywood. Oh wow, he was on an episode. Oh, he came right. He out. was on an yeah. episode. <laughs> nice. Oh, nice. That took us eight. Going. That was crazy. I'm very glad that we got both because the third one I know is about to be crazy because he came up with it. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so yeah. Like, and, I, and I do like winning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I do like winning. Well, I thought, right. what is the craziest I could go to? And I just the third one. I'm just watching that show Shogun oh, on yeah. FX. Yeah, it's a really good show. So. We're going with the Meiji Restoration. It's a period in Japan where... <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Meiji Restoration? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> it's oh, the, no. the period of Japan where they opened up and they caught up with the world and then became a global military superpower. Wow. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So now we have to get to the Meiji Restoration <laughs> to <laughs> well, Kevin Hart. I can hear Zangus. Val's vagina drying. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, all right. Wait, is this what the show is about? The Shogun show? No, this sh Shogun takes place before this. Okay. But I was like, I just wanted to pick a major era mm. of Japan. And this was this was. I got I excited. Of. I saw Matthew Perry, and I was like, "Man, that's not." <laughs> no, <laughs> hey, yeah. Also, died in a hot tub. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> all right, uh, so we gotta we gotta let's 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 go down sort of slowly and see what we got here. Do we start with like just Japan and then get to like Nintendo? Mm. Do we get like how do we get to America? Mm. Good point. They Good have point. hold on, real, real quick, real quick. They have something up there called Western Ideas. Oh, okay. And I, I would imagine stand up would fall into that category, right? Or, Kevin or Hart maybe himself. art. There's got to be yeah. art. If it's like Western culture civilization, it's got to be. I think we can look there. All right. Let's, All right, let's, try. let's, let's go. Let's go. Western ideas. One. Okay. If we can get to slavery. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's crazy? Is if we would get there quicker. Yeah. 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 Oh, slavery yeah. would be way quicker. Go from slavery right to like LeBron James. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Uh, oh, media. 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 Boy, okay. You're good. Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh, wow. Damn, Printing like press. Media, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Television, radio Television slots. Television and radio slots. Huh. Or we could just click on the Western media whole thing, I think. All right. Yeah, but if we. That's another click, though. Oh, we just fuck. went to another yeah, thing. Right. I will count it as like, the main article. Okay. That's Thank fair. you, Val. Yeah, hello. Like All right. All right. Val. That's we're slot two. All right. Damn. Mm. This is more muse media than like types of media. Right. Ugh. What's so old? Yeah, right. Characteristics. What are characteristics? Yeah. Global coverage. Africa. Africa. <laughs> <laughs> we all felt it. We yeah, all yeah. Felt it. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, well, we have ABC, CBS, NBC here. Or stereotypes. That'd be comedy, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, okay. Racial myths. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. They don't all have big dicks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard that joke 900 times. It's still funny. It's still funny. Like it's still so funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Take that, black people. You got little dicks. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. I went to public school. <laughs> <laughs> um, man, NBC. And because I, I feel like you can go NBC to Cosby, right? Was the first oh, yeah. huge dick you seen black? Uh, well, I saw porn real young, okay. and it was a white guy with a huge hog. But mm. in yeah, real was, life, probably the first huge hog I ever saw was also a white guy. Oh, really? Yeah. There you go. Tyler Watkins. Tyler oh, Watkins. Wow. Shout out. Year. Shout out. Ty shout out Tyler. Yeah. Yes. Tight end. Oh, no, damn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What a great right. shot. I hope he sees this. No, you know what's funny? I saw him at a show in Arizona. I was open for Adam Ray, mm. and he, he was there with his his fiance, and I saw him, and I was like, yo, Tyler, what are you doing? We're talking and hanging out, and I, was, and I looked at his fiance, I was like, his dick's huge, right? Yeah. And she was like, yeah. We <laughs> 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 got nose. <laughs> <laughs> and when you see a guy with a huge dong with a girl, you can't not think about her getting plowed. I'm like, right. you know? and like I was happy for it. Too. Yeah, like, dude, sure. that's awesome. Yeah. 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 Thing. I She's... know what that thing is. Yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. It's probably bigger. Yeah. It's been years. Yeah, it's probably grown. <laughs> and she's just getting pile dry. Oh, yeah, that's crazy. What if, yeah, his, he grew into his dick still? It's like, it's like oh, my God. He was a sophomore at that time. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that was the first one. I was like, what the fuck? They're that? Like, what is that? Yeah. Damn. All right. Okay, well, we got to figure this out here. Uh, Newsweek. I, I bet Kevin Hart's been on Newsweek, but again, it's... it's I think... Yeah. I think if we go to NBC, ABC, or CBS, I think we'll come across a TV show. NBC, yeah. NBC. Yeah, NBC. Let's do NBC. That'll put us in the world of... Because then we can get to Seinfeld. Yeah. Mm. Comedians in Cars. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Good let's call. see if we can get to Seinfeld, so we can get from, get Seinfeld from here. Seinfeld, should, it should be like the first let's, thing to put up. Yeah, it should just be Seinfeld. <laughs> was, it was NBC, right? Yep. Okay. Bro, connections. Hey! Oh, bro, hey. hey. Great hat. Hey. Game one. <laughs> Game like, one. Game one. Game one. Game one. Yeah, let's go. To, let's see what's under programming. There's got to be. I I can't imagine. So, here, here we go. We here we go. Oh, okay. Former. Perfect. 86. Oh, these are all news, though. Oh, yeah. Syndicated, Syndicated. production. Okay. Oh, but that's Chris Matthews' show. Other productions. Huh. They're, they're really missing out on. Oh, wow. I guess this is just NBC News, though. Yeah. Mm. How do we get to NBC do we go Peacock? We can go. Okay, go up, go up. If we want to get into... No, sorry, that's way too far off. 
If we want to go, go down a little bit. It's in there somewhere. I just saw. Okay. Brian Williams' daughter, Allison Williams, is the white girl in Get Out. Mm. That puts us in movies. Black That's movies. That's true. <laughs> With Jordan Peele. <laughs> With Jordan Peele. That's as black yeah. as it gets. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 huh. I like that. Oh. So There's two clicks. I like it. I like it. Oh, okay. Well, here's here's a route. I can already I can already go. We can go. We can go. Brian Williams. So Brian Williams to Get Out to Jordan Peele to Fargo. Jordan oh. Peele was on the first season of Fargo to Chris Rock. Chris Rock was on the third season. Was to Kevin Hart. That gives us nine. That's nine. I feel like we've used Chris Rock. Yeah, yeah okay, so okay. Let's, let's, yeah, yeah, we're close. We're close. We're close down to Chris Rock. I, I think we can get there with Seinfeld. Like we're right yeah. here in NBC. Mm -hmm. I know. So right now we're still at three. Who the fuck is Chris Matthews? Yeah, who is that? That's a famous news guy. He's done a bunch of those shows. Like mm -hmm. I remember seeing him with uh, when he got in trouble with the Oscar thing. Ooh, Letterman. Letterman. Oh, okay. That's where we go. I think okay. We go I, 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 let's go. Let, let's go, Letterman. I like this. Definitely been on there. Oh, they also have the Tonight Show, which he's been on more recently. Yes. Mm. Okay, so we're at Letterman. So, okay. who do we? Well, you There's go. Jerry Lewis. Oh, damn. Who's been on Comedians in Cars? Jerry Lewis has been on Comedians with Cars. Oh yeah. Wait, oh, damn. can we go click Jerry Lewis? Yeah, Jerry Lewis is under the picture of Letterman. I think we click Jerry Lewis. I think yeah. his Comedians in Cars will be on there. Okay. All right, let's go to his. Uh, Filmography? Does he have one? No, that's how he killed it so hard. They were like, don't even. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, You're right? just in popular culture. He has a bibliography. He's like a book. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> He's got a bibliography and a biography. Bro, I've never seen someone have a bibliography in the middle. Did he do stand up, like traditional stand up? Uh, I think he like was like an MC kind of thing. But Comedians okay. in Cars Getting Coffee. Yeah. That was a good call, oh man. God. Okay, now, oh, okay, now we, can just, we just have to find which season Kevin Hart was on, right? Oh, yeah. He had he had one of my favorite quotes on his comedian Kevin's uh, comedian's heart. Uh, really? Carson. Yeah, he goes, uh, "Time is undefeated." Yeah, yeah, he did yeah. Say that. They're he, talking about L.A. There yeah, is Kevin Hart. Kevin wow. Hart, boys. Wow. Uh, we got there in seven. We got there from Meiji Restoration. Unbelievable! <laughs> Unbelievable! You know, yeah. great, there, I remember the Kevin Hart comedians of cars too. He, uh, Kevin said something great. He said, "Well, Jerry said something." Kevin was talking about how his, his kids are, you know, rich. Mm, I remember this trying to well. raise them not to be so rich and like let them know how he had, he was grew up and yada yada and like how hard it was so they can understand. Mm. And then Jerry said, "No, that's that's going to be your curse." Is you grew up poor, so your whole life was how do I make it better? Yeah, and they're gonna grow up rich, so their whole life will be why do I feel so bad? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> boy, like, ain't that the truth? Yeah. God. All right, so that was the first game. Hey, hey. the Wikipedia three three. game, three for three. We, we did, did it. Yeah, we, we just a little had to stick with it, a little tenacity. We yeah. got there. Yeah, and I like that we didn't we didn't go through the Chris Rock's uh, path again. That was yes. that was good. Uh, uh, we went from black to Jew. Yeah, you know, <laughs> yeah. We, we flipped it. comedy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes, exactly. exactly. That's true. That's number one and two in the power rankings of comedy. <laughs> <laughs> Constant battle. Yeah. yeah, George Carlin somewhere pissed off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. Uh, the, our second game okay. uh, it's, it's going to be you and Derek Derek's going to help you out Since we love movies here We have eight Kevin Hart movies He was in Some of them cameo something And guess how much Well, I guess from lowest to highest Box office take Ooh mm -hmm. Okay Alright so Val We, can we do ready this. to pull this up The box oh, office not, not this one. Yeah, There it is Best to worst Highest box office Highest box office okay. To lowest box office And, 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 uh, and I'll, 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 write it, I'll write down your list It'll be you two together Out of all eight no, no, yeah, yeah. You start with the lowest one. We do, you do all eight. The okay. lowest one to the highest one. Got it. Lowest to highest. Wow, this is actually going to be kind of difficult. This is actually going to be very difficult. He's in Forty Year Old Virgin. Yeah, he has oh. a favorite, real cameo. He has a Remember famous he cameo. He, has the, uh, he goes in. He asks the other black dude for a discount. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, they a and they get into fight. it. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's going to come back and shoot the place up. Yeah. It's like great. <laughs> Whatever happened to that guy? He was good. He, he had a little run. He was in that. He was in Weeds. weeds. Romany Malco. Oh, Romany yeah. Malco. Yeah. Romany Malco. I remember him. I was oh. like, he he had a look too. He Blades looked interesting. Glory. Blades like, no, of Glory. Like, he yeah. After hit like a run, and mm -hmm. then it just ended. It's kind of like Justin Long. There's guys who just like yeah. Where you're ah. just in everything in this huge run, and then it's like over really. Quick. Right. Yeah, there, there is there is something to the fact that like if you're in a lot of things at once, you kind of sort of disappear later. Mm. A little bit, like like remember that Joseph Gordon Levitt run that was insane. Jeez, yeah, yeah. yeah and now you, you don't see him around that often. Not at all. Yeah. No. yeah, I think we're gonna see that. I mean, I 
my theory was before Jonathan Majors got like in trouble was because he was in everything. I was like, I think he's gonna. Oh, interesting. F- like you know, I think there's something to, to be said about taking everything that comes. No, your the way. best pace themselves. Like the one guy, mm. the actor. Who I think I look. I can tell this guy's gonna be around. Is that Daniel Kaluuya guy? The one from No, oh, he kind of yeah. like he kind of like drops a movie every like three to four. Like Denzel's kind of pacing, you know right, what I mean? right, 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 right. I think that is the best way to Daniel Day Lewis. Daniel Day Lewis. Every yeah. few years, Bale yeah. doesn't do it on every year. You know what I mean? I think there's something to pace. Yeah. yeah, right. <laughs> All right, I think the lowest. If I had, to, I mean, scary movie four probably, right? Yeah, yeah. I think I'm gonna go with you. It is the fourth. We we got it. <laughs> you know, the first one was great. Second one was solid. Third, eh, you, you kind of fall off. Yeah. So I like that logic. I would go that fourth. I would go, wait, is it, I'd go Jumanji 2 might not have done great. It might not have. But you know what, though? If for sure, well, that is the a big one. the first one made a billion, and I know that second one made oh. a billion. Oh, the first okay. one made a billion. So I know that second one had to come at least near 800 million. All right, you're right. I might go Central Intelligence then. Yeah, I'm gonna go Central Intelligence. So scary movie four, Central Intelligence. Okay, we're See, working our way up. Yeah. All right. Probably. I think kids movies do huge. I know. Numbers. I was about to say probably Little Fockers. Maybe Little Fockers. Because Forty Year Virgin was a phenomenon. <laughs> Runaway hit. Yeah. So we'll go Fockers. Yeah. Ride Along could be in there. I yeah. I think I think you're right. I think it would go Ride Along, then probably Pets. Okay. Then forty year old virgin, then Jumanji two, then Jumanji one. If That's I had to get pretty guess. good. What That's, do you think? I think you're right, but I'm worried about pets. Pets is a fucking sleeper. <laughs> yeah, dude, pets is crazy. It's not in our world. We're not kids or pedophiles, so we don't really God. see that kind of shit. But those do crazy numbers because parents can just put it in front of a kid mm-hmm. and <laughs> and you know have sex. And pedophile or not, I still saw it. I went. Oh, you did? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. The, the first Louis one was fun. The first one yeah. was a lot of fun. I remember, remember that like was it. right before Louis got drunk. That's right. This yeah. Prime That's Louis right. Yeah. And then, yes. I, I remember I didn't watch. Secret Life Pets 2 out of Solidarity with Louie. I was like, yeah. I don't need this. I don't need this. Yeah. Pat Oswalt, fucking <laughs> traitor. <laughs> you can't be another animal, Patton. You were already Ratatouille. Yeah, yeah, true. You can't be another animal. True. Yeah. You're right. Ellen's a fish. Ellen's a fish. Yeah. And, and well, you know what's crazy? If she came back as another type of fish, you'd be like, come on, this is too much. Damn, that's actually a good point. Chris Tucker is a, I mean, Chris Rock is a zebra. Yeah, once you're an animal, you're an animal. You're once that you're animal. One, I feel well, like especially you are. if you're uh, iconic. Ratatouille is one of the greatest movies of all time. Yeah, yeah it's a big one. <laughs> yeah. Yo, all right. I think we need. To, you're right. You 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 scared me about Secret Life of Pets. It probably is. I, I think Jumanji One has to be as biggest. Re- okay. Because I just don't know. That was such a big deal. That was a big deal. But forty year old virgin. Yeah, I don't 40-year-old know. Forty year old virgin for sure made, has made more money in. Forever, but in the box office, I wonder. Okay, yeah. It's older, though. That's why like, you still went to the box office, is yeah. what I'm saying. But it also is a raunchy comedy where that's a family. <laughs> this was rated R. So, yeah, there you go. So this was kind of like that hangover vibe where it's like, yes. it was huge, but it was huge for like, I mean, it's a, for a rated R movie to make probably, like, if I had to guess, Four hundred million. Right. That's insanity. That's insane. And mm-hmm. it was kind of indie style. Like it was kind of low budget. And this is mm-hmm. yeah, that's Judd Apatow's mm-hmm. first. Is it's that one, that one of his yeah. first big, one? first big ones. Yeah. And, first big one, right? and 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 I think a lot of Forty Year Old Virgin too. At least from when I when I remember when I was a kid was people who watched it was like, hey, you should watch this. Yeah, yeah. Like you know what I mean? It wasn't it wasn't so much of a like, oh, you got to rush to the. It was like, oh, someone's watching. Like, oh, this is good. Yeah, my dad. I remember my dad was like, you yeah. got to watch this. Yeah. I, did, I didn't. I didn't watch it in theaters. I remember that. I Same. remember I watched it. I watched it afterwards, after yeah. everyone was talking about it. All right, so let's see. We got Jumanji. Mm-hmm. Then we're we're maybe debating pets or Jumanji two. I think I think you go pets because you, you right. scared me with the animated kids. You got me like you're right. That thing probably made a billion plus. And that's the original. The original. That's the yeah, original. Yeah. That's the original. I, I didn't know right. the so only, Then yeah. we'll say two Jumanji. Okay, so okay. you go Jumanji uh, pets, Jumanji two. And then I think we said scary movie. No, 40, oh, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40, 40 year virgin. 40 year virgin. Then okay. scary movie. Yes. Then so, so you you go so you go f- scary movie after forty year old virgin. Yes. Okay. And then was it? So you have right along little fuckers and central intelligence left. Okay. I, I think I think I think we go. I, I think probably last was probably little fuckers. Okay. No, it was last central intelligence. I think it's central intelligence. Last central intelligence. Because you still got Stiller and yeah, uh, De Niro. And, and it's a it's a it's a uh, what you call it, a trilogy. Yeah, you know, it's, a, it's yeah. a franchise. It's a franchise. I'm gonna go franchise. I think. I think last place. You're right. I think last place is Central Intelligence. Okay. Mm-hmm. Second to last, right along, then Little Fockers. There okay. you go. I okay. like it. So, um, 
Let me let me go through your list and see if you guys want to lock it in. So from highest to lowest, Jumanji, Pets, Jumanji 2, 40 Year Old Virgin, Scary Movie 4, Little Fockers, Ride Along, Central Intelligence. Lock it in. Lock, lock, it, lock in. it in. Okay. I will say this. You guys did pretty good up top. Uh, up top was up top. You nailed it. Up, oh. the, up top went Jumanji Pets Jumanji Two. Oh, Whoa, come on! Yeah, that was, that, was great. Great. that was pretty impressive. That was pretty impressive. So Jumanji That's a box office. Yeah. yeah. So Jumanji nine hundred ninety five million. Woo! Why did they let us pick these fucking movies? <laughs> <laughs> come on! Secret Life of Pets. You nailed it. Eight hundred eighty five million. Like wow. it was very much like. That's, that's what kids yeah. you, kids movies are like that. Yeah. I and mean, that's Prime Louie. I mean that's Yeah, that's Kevin right. Hart. And that's Kevin right. Hart. And I remember the the trailers were good. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And there's something that I've never I'll never forget my cousin. This is years ago. I visited him in LA. He had a little baby. And he was putting on kids YouTube for him. And I looked at the views of that video. Just some random video teaching a kid how to count to 10, 1.6 it's billion. Insane. Yeah. It's like it's it's what the kids' numbers are crazy. Um, you guys put 40 year old virgin as number five. In fact, number five was Little Fockers, 310 million. Whoa, franchise. Franchise, franchise. franchise and like this is, I think, really before the De Niro decline. Right, right, right. <laughs> and, and it had some star power. You got Owen Wilson. I think you got Barbara Streisand, is yeah, it? Jessica yeah, Jessica. This is Jessica Alba, but she's still oh, Jessica Alba. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like this, this, this was a crazy movie. I actually never saw this one. I saw the. I saw. <laughs> it's not the best. Val's favorite movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just find out yeah. Val's an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> 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 favorite movie's Little Fox. <laughs> so you guys have Scary Movie Four as number four. Oh, uh, uh, sorry, number five. Number five is actually Central Intelligence with two hundred seventeen million. That's oh, no wonder they can wow. make a movies together. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah like, like, I think I think you guys are really when you were talking about it, you're really underestimating that pair up because that yeah. was their first movie together. Yeah, and that was such a big deal. Uh, yeah, right. yeah, that's it. on me. Yeah, and then it came after that, and then. You put Little Fockers after that. It's actually Scary Movie Four mm. with 178 million. Damn, that's not a lot. No, yeah, no. Uh, th there, be I think there comes a certain time if you, especially like the early 2000s, where at a certain point the box office numbers I think get super inflated because of inflation and all sure. that stuff too. So I think yeah. there was a, a little of that that I don't think guys because then the second to last you guys put right along is actually 40 Year Old Virgin. Mm. 177 million went, made one less million than Scary But then I, I'm imagining why that was such a big deal, like you said, because it was the indie vibes. I'm, I'm yeah. assuming its budget was probably what 20 million, maybe exactly. 30 million. Exactly. Yes. Unknown Jonah Hill. Mm -hmm. it, it was real uh, kind of bare bones. Yeah. And then and then what it made afterwards as like yes. the, you know the DVD the, the, sales, the, DVD sales mm. the cult, you know the right. the uh, you know how I know you're gay. That yeah. thing. I remember I remember seeing those God. clips on the internet, early internet. And Definitely. that being like a that was like one of the first memes, kind of. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. you and like then Coldplay. yeah, and then the lowest one is right along with 154 million. All right, all right. But they still made a second one, so Wait, they felt oh. they felt like. I'm assuming the budget was probably low. They probably budgeted maybe 25, 30 mil. Right. And then you're like, well, this just made so much money. Yeah. <laughs> you know, but that is this is like Kevin Hart just ascension. Yes. Yes. God, yes. he was in all these. He was in all he's these. He's a busy guy. Yeah, what he's the in all fuck? these. I'm also just now taking it in. Like, he was in Little Fockers. Like, he's in, yeah, he's, yeah. I didn't know he was in that he's either. A, he's, he plays a nurse. Is <laughs> he the Little Fucker? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's the little guy. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it is a very impressive, like, I mean, the straight up Jumanji's, the first Jumanji might be one of the funniest comedy movies of recent is memory. Is that right? Have you, did you see it? No, mm -hmm. no. Man, genuinely, in the theater, dying laughing. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Like, I was yeah. also going in expecting just like to see an action movie or whatever. Sure. Right, or, or like or like a just sort of cookie cutter movie. Corny. Junk food. Family. Like a junk food yeah, type movie. Right, and then, right. You know, as you're watching, the moment it starts, the, your first thought is, oh, I forgot how funny Jack Black is. Right. Like your immediate reaction is like, oh yeah, Jack Black is him. Yeah. <laughs> when is he ever not like yeah. even as a panda? Yeah. <laughs> as an animated yeah, panda, he's yeah. so funny. That's true. By the way, that's his animal. <laughs> yeah, that's his animal. That's true. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, he can't be any other one. No. Yeah, I won't take it. I can't believe it. Right. It's it's weird. Yeah, but you know, uh if you haven't seen Jumanji, like genuinely a very funny film. Like a pure comedy. They don't make many of those anymore. Yep. Yeah. And what's it's for kids. So it's like, you yeah. know, a kid's movie that makes an adult laugh. Big money. That's and that, and that's a good movie because yeah. you, know, you can reach everybody. That's True. hard. That's hard to do. True. Yeah, it's also really good. It's good comedy. It, it is. You're watching it, and the whole time, it's not like it's the best movie you've ever seen or the best comedy you've ever seen. But you are laughing the whole time, and like, and genuinely laughing. Like, damn, that's a good joke. Okay. Damn, that's a good joke. Damn, maybe I'll watch it. Yeah, yeah. It's 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 worth. It's fun. It's. I'd imagine it's a wonderful plain movie. 
If you're yeah, on a plane, Mark, you, you throw it. that motherfucker on. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're, I, I bet you it gets you a couple times. Yeah. Where you're like, God <laughs> yeah, damn, yeah, yeah. I'm dying on this plane. Yeah. They're going to walk by and be like, that's a professional comedian watching Jumanji. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Just crying. <Yeah>. <laughs> 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 All right, I'll check it out. Better than my usual choice, which is Final Destination. Oh, which, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's just highlights yeah. of 9-11. It's yeah. just like, what do you want? <laughs> Either that, flight, Sully. Yeah. <laughs> All right, last, the last game. Oh, right. Mm -hmm. you know, one more game. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Uh, this one involves a little more you. This, one's oh. a little, this one we're really going to see who's Kevin Hart. Okay. Yeah. All right. right. Bring so it on. To explain it? All right. So we're going to give you, there's going to be two columns. One, events in Kevin Hart's life. One, events in your life. You match uh, two of the, like, you, each event correlates with another event in years. So, okay. like, so-and-so happened the same year, just try to match them up. See which event happened the same year. Well, if it's my shit, won't I know it? Well, you'll know no, the no, year. You'll have to know the year, but you have to know, like, what, what happened in Kevin, Kevin Hart's, Hart's life God. that year as well. Okay. You'll, you'll, see, all, you'll see the game. You'll see when you see, when you see, the, board. see the board. All right. Yeah, all yeah. Right. It's, yeah. You remember those uh, games that go like this in school where you, like, got to yes. draw? Yes. That's yes. what you're doing. That's, right. what, that's right. what you're Great. doing here. So there's a Kevin, the, all the Mark events are on the left, all the Kevin Hart events are on the right. <laughs> you know what sucks is he doesn't have the sense of humor to see how funny and ridiculous this is. Like, he'll never see this. He'll be like, what the fuck are they talking about? If he ever saw a clip of this. That's the goal. I know. Kevin Hart to see a clip of this. And like, be like, Why? what the yeah, fuck? <laughs> yeah, I brought him up once in the cellar, and I was like, thank you, I'm Kevin Hart. Hey, we got a real treat, Kevin Hart. And... <laughs> <laughs> he didn't even think twice about it. He didn't even catch it. Oh my God, that's crazy. Yeah. I was like, this will be my moment. I thought he was going to say, I'm Mark Norman, but he didn't. Uh, 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 you know, you're hanging out with like Drake and Taylor Swift so much that you don't even notice. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. He didn't even recognize you as a person. No. You're not just, at all. <laughs> all right, not let me all. just real quick, just to help you out. So, the Mark events, we got started comedy, your first Rogan. Bombing at the VMAs, which I would love to hear. I didn't even know that was oh, a thing. Crazy story. Yeah. When Caroline on Broadway's March Madness competition. That's oh, yeah. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, Don't Be Yourself is released. Wow. Comedy Up Late in Melbourne. Jesus. And Graduated High School. Okay, that I know. <laughs> the Kevin Hart events. First movie with The Rock. Friend charged with extortion. That was Ooh. a big one. Yeah, yeah. Witness 9 11 on TV, most likely. <laughs> Sex tape released. Stars in Scary Movie 4. <laughs> Let Me Explain released. And that major car crash. Oh, yeah. Now I got to do the years of those. Well, yeah. Well, you have to match up which is so. W when they both happen. So you're yeah. not saying the year, just like, so when you start a comedy, oh, that's when you're the same year the that same this year. happened with Kevin Hart. Yeah, 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 Okay, yeah. okay. All right, all yes. right. All right, I graduated high school in 2001. Mm -hmm. Wow. So I'm old. So I guess uh, <laughs> that was 2001 was when his... Ooh. I mean, Ooh. I mean, Ooh. I mean Mark, I, I genuinely Ooh. thought this would be a layup. Yeah, I thought this one was a layup too. Maybe just go through it. Okay, you said you graduated high school. What year? 01. Now go through it. What do you think happened in 01 that is the biggest deal on this? We'll go 9 11. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> That's a good call. <laughs> Sorry, I looked at you. <laughs> uh, all right. Good, thank you for walking me through that. There was a certain point I realized that he also wasn't in a bit. I was like, oh, no, he doesn't yeah, yeah. see it at all. I missed the 9-11 one. <laughs> oh, God damn. All right, we got one. We got one. Mm -hmm. one okay, one. okay. Mm -hmm. Don't Be Yourself was released in 2016, I want to say. Uh, so that was probably maybe his first <coughs> movie with, with R The Rock. Um, I don't know if you can help me. Yeah, I can help you. Your first movie with The Rock. Let's see. Uh, you know what's funny? The Kevin of, uh, you said 2016. 2016 was Kevin's first movie with The Rock, but it was not your life event. Oh, oh shit. My wow. bad. <laughs> All right. Even, okay. this, this is based off of Wikipedia, so maybe. Right. I, <laughs> well, maybe the VMAs. No, the Melbourne. Okay, yeah, Melbourne. It's, the, it's, the, it's the Melbourne comedy up late in Melbourne. It's a yes. it's a video that you're you, you posted on YouTube recently. That's why yeah. I was like, oh, let me. It says 2016 next to it. So wow, I was like, yeah. that was the first movie with The Rock. Yes, that okay. was Central Intelligence. It was oh. his first movie with The Rock. Yeah, which did wow. very well. Mm -hmm. All right. I started comedy in 08, I mean, uh, 06. Mm -hmm. I'll say that's when he did the sex tape. 
No. 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 Okay. How about this? The uh, let me explain. No. Oh fuck me. This is tough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this, this, this was genuinely tough. The extortion. I didn't even know it happened. Oh um, yeah. That's how I think that's that's linked to the sex tape being released. Actually. Oh. The, the shit. sex tape got released because his friend was like blackmailing him. Holy moly. Yeah. There's some, it's some crazy. We can look that up after we're done with this. But that's a, that's some that's a crazy story. All right. Wait. So you started comedy. You said oh eight. Oh six. Oh six. Yeah. I would have to guess. Scary movie. That makes was sense. It scary movie four? It was scary movie four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He doesn't know the. Barry doesn't know, know the answer. I haven't seen this yet either. Yeah, so, so I was like, okay. All right, I think I got one. Don't be yourself. Came out in 2017. Yes. And that's the car crash. No. Damn. Let's let me explain. Uh, 2017. No. Interesting. Uh huh. Is that the extortion? Close. Oh, the sex that's tape. The sex tape? That's the sex wow, tape. Wow, is that recent? Mm -hmm. that's, yeah, I oh. know. That's crazy. A lot of this is like 17, 18, 19. Okay, got Dude, it. Dude, this guy's life has been fucking nuts. A wild yeah, roller yeah. coaster. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That means that scary movie. No, you, you already got scary movie. Oh. That was the 2006. That was you and starting comedy. Oh, okay, got it. Mm -hmm. So that means the bombing of the uh, VMAs was 2018? That was 2018. And that's got to be... The extortion. That's the extortion. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Wow. So rough, went back to back. Yeah, rough years for you and Kevin in 2018. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Wait, what was the bombing at the VMAs? Uh, I had to. They have a host at the VMAs, but they do a warm up guy. So that was the warm up guy. You do 10 minutes up front, like, hey, everybody, you ready to have a good time? Da da da. And I was bombing so bad. I was supposed to do 10. I think they, they walked me off at seven, like, no one's paying attention. Ooh. J Lo would walk by and go, Hey, J Lo. She was like, ah. <laughs> Oh my God. Pete Davidson's with Ariana Grande. I'm riffing on that. No one's listening. Everybody's in the crowd selfieing. It's all these hot kids and, you know, cool teenagers and shit. No one gave a fuck. People started heckling me. It's in Radio City, 5,000 seats. Brutal. I'm in a suit, sweating. Horrible. Well, so what was, I guess, what was your, like, when you got out there, what was the first thing you did? Did you try to do a joke or were you trying to riff? Like, what, what was the disconnect? They weren't even looking like they were all mm. sitting like this, you know, talking mm. to each other and people were coming those in. Tables, like, kind of yeah, like that. Yeah, right. Fancy exactly. Tables, yeah. Right. Exactly. So it was just, they didn't even care. So it wasn't even like I could get them. Then I started riffing on people and they'd be like, fuck you, shut up. <laughs> and then you're like, okay, don't do that. And it got so bad that I had a friend there and he just walked up to the stage and took a selfie of him and me bombing. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's. That's how, like, no one gave a shit. He just walked up to the stage and did this. No, my uh, God. Yeah, and I think he went like that. <laughs> so, oh my God. It was so bad. I can't even do it justice. Like, just no, 5,000 people not listening and not even paying attention. Mm -hmm. It's one thing to get silence. Right. But this was like, they were just talking. And this is 2018. Yeah. Would you say this is your hardest bomb? No, That's crazy. No, I've had some worse bombs. What? Wait, what's, yeah. what's your worst bomb then? Oh, geez. I did a show. Uh, at the cellar, and this guy came over. He's like, "Dude, that was great. I have a hedge fund company. I want you to come roast them." <laughs> and I was like, "All right." It was at a country club upstate. Nothing but Ferraris and Lamborghinis in the audience. These are all trillionaires. I get in there. It's a beautiful golf club kind of thing, and it's white tablecloths and waiters and everything. And they gave me a rap sheet of like, "Dirt on this guy. Dirt on this guy." So he's just like, "Just shit on everybody. Make it vicious." I was like, "All right." So I go, "Hey, Bob," and Bob's there with his wife. Hey. We all know you're cheating on your wife. <laughs> and the wife's like, what? I knew it. She throws water on him. The kids are crying. Yeah, I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Moving on. Uh, hey, Cliff, we all know you got a Coke problem. And he's like, shut the fuck up. My, my sponsor's here. My kids are here, you know. And, uh, so it was bad. It was really bad. Then I tried to go to material after that to save it. I was like, what's up with cereal? You know? <laughs> and uh, it was horrible. And the guy kicked me out of the club. But he gave me all the all the fucking dirt. Oh, how much time do you think you did? I'm I was saying. supposed to do 40 or 30 or 40. I probably did like nine. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> it was bad. It was bad. What year was this? That was probably like 2013 or 14. Okay, so you're okay. more, okay. Because 2018, you're like, you're already kind of doing stuff, right? I had right? a couple things out of my yeah, belt. Well, damn, yeah, I, yeah. Yeah, the, the, that YouTube, the Comedy Central special, that was on YouTube too, right? Uh, was that the one that hit now. A, Okay. It is now. I, there was like a string of y'all when I first started coming up. Like you, like you, Muriel, and I think List, you guys would just have these specials that would just hit a million. 
right. on YouTube. Yeah. That was like a th I remember that being a thing. Yeah, not everyone was doing it yet. So right. it was still kind of new and interesting. Right. No, everyone I remember being at the store and everyone being like, they're doing it on YouTube. They're doing yeah. it on yeah. YouTube. That was at the store. Right. That was such the conversation. Because mm -hmm. it was a failure. Like nobody'll buy it. Put right. it on YouTube. You know, I guess we'll see if we can get some clicks and then it would hit. Yeah, so, it turns out that's how that's the, the kind of better way to do it. Yeah. Well, exactly. I think you got you got in on YouTube right when Netflix started overdoing it. It was yes. like it was like a, the perfect timing. Right. Of like, well, there's yeah, already too much that. stuff on Netflix. Oh, look, this stuff for free that I don't have to, you know. And Netflix is already doing that thing where they're canceling shows. Like Netflix yeah. is starting to become like this bloated giant that it is yes, now. Yes, yeah, yeah. exactly. And Netflix got mm -hmm. a little queefy for a while. Like you couldn't yeah. say everything, yes. but on YouTube, you're like, let it fly, which right. now is flipped. Mm. Now Chappelle is saying crazy shit on Netflix, and then YouTube is censoring. Like Fahim got flagged for saying cunt or something. Yeah, yeah did, didn't something happen with List as well? Yes, the special. Yes, right, exactly. Right, it's, yeah, it's 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 wild that there's not. It's wild that there can't be a free speech platform that isn't associated with being like righty. I know. You know what I, I mean? Know. Like 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 r the idea of Rumble is so cool, except. Everyone who's on there is just like a certain way politically, yeah, so it's like yeah. fuck. Like out like suits. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah all yeah. denim American flag. It's yeah. like what the fuck. <laughs> yeah, that fucking shaman who is at the uh, January six with yeah, the yeah. moose head. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think he's like the CEO of Rumble. <laughs> yeah, <exactly. laughs> all right, so we have a couple. You have your okay. first Rogan, your Caroline's win. And I think that's it. Yeah, I your first Rogan and Caroline's. What was your first Rogan? I think it was 2019. Yes, that was. Okay, wow. mm -hmm. okay. That was back when it was on YouTube, yes. which it is again, but it was a big, that was a big boost in a career back really? in the day. It was mm -hmm. like doing Johnny Carson. So when you did it, like, the, like uh, by big boost, just because, was the next day? Was it like, or what, how did that happen? After like, you did it? Uh, I was, uh, I could fill up, you know, half a room at a club, maybe. And then after Rogan, every, every show filled up and you'd add shows. At clubs, so that really? was a big jump. We're talking wow. about like the, like the next weekend, like yeah, right after. Wow. yeah, right after <laughs> it was it was huge, and I just put out a uh, YouTube special, mm -hmm. so it was like Rogan YouTube special, and then Seinfeld happened to shout me out, so I had this great trifecta mm. all in like a couple of weeks, and it just bl blasted me. And also such demographic differences. Yeah, like Seinfeld and Rogan to, right. at the same yeah. time, and then imagine. YouTube, right? Yeah. Oh, and how long? Well, how long had you been doing comedy at that point in 2019? I started in 06. So oh, yeah. Whatever yeah, that well, is. yeah. 15 <laughs> so, years. So, yeah, yeah. 13 years, pretty much. That's, yeah. yeah, that's, you know, I think that's a, what a lot of people don't realize is just how long some oh, of this yeah. stuff really takes. Cause, like, you know, the average person, you just showed up 2019. Right. But they didn't know, like, the fucking the Caroline's Broadway that you had to win. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Was, it? was that great winning that? That yeah. was awesome. I've, I've probably done 50 contests. <laughs> I've only won two. Okay. Because you know how contests are. <laughs> yeah. They're yeah. the worst. But they do help. Back then, that was a good, like, hey, my name's out there a lot because I won, you mm -hmm. know? Because back, I started so long ago. I don't know when you guys started. I started in 2013. Yeah. Okay. I, start, I started, uh, which 20... was the year you did the on well, the Broadway competition. Oh, I'll, I'll get that there. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So, yeah, I still had, like, TV was still important when I started. Mm -hmm. I've done nine Conans, four Tonight Shows, Colbert, Corden. Yes, I saw six late needle. nights. Yeah. Didn't move the needle one bit. I, I slaved over those sets, God. you know, mm -hmm. like, pulling my hair out over getting the jokes right and not fucking it up. Didn't move the needle, did one Rogan, you know. Right, so. one Rogan where you didn't have to overthink yeah, of what exactly. you were saying. You, know, you could just hang out. That's so crazy. Didn't prepare, smoked weed, <laughs> yeah. you know, the whole thing. Talking so. about trans kids. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Spaceship, <laughs> you got it. <laughs> but, yeah, so it, I still wasted a lot of time on all that TV shit. Like, I did a Comedy Central hour. Nobody saw it. Right. You know, right. then I put the YouTube one out. That's so it funny. Blew I up. saw the hour on your Wikipedia page. It's like, ah, I'll just do the YouTube yeah, for, the, for the game. Yeah. Even for the game, I was like, yeah. Well, yeah, because Comedy Central by the time well, I was past college by then, it was I wasn't watching it. Who was no, watching it? Tosh yeah. was the last. That was the last thing I was watching. That, last that was it. But I, I remember watching like Premium Blend and oh, like all this too. stuff. I me remember too. watching that. I think yeah. they really did a disservice when they moved the presents away from that theater with the background that you could customize oh, into that like man. sanitized studio I hated where it was that. just your name and it looked like it looked like a studio as opposed to that theater like i think yeah. it was genuinely a horrible move to do that cuz i always think about the classic nick sorton one where he's like look at this picture nicholas oh, yeah, 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 yeah. and it's like they, or, or other people who got to riff on their sets yeah, right. and it was like damn that was better it just made it more in the room like, yeah, oh, this is like it, yeah. more individual yeah. it was just painted cutter. a better picture i remember i was watching uh, freddie soto's when i was young mm. and he, he, all his jokes were about his kid and his being a kid and his dad 
and in the background was a family home. Uh, so it's almost like, you know what I mean? It's just the the paint the picture it paints is so much better and you're so much more into it. Yeah. Yeah, I it, get. Comedy was so sitcom based back then. It was mm -hmm. like do your dad jokes, your mom jokes, or I grew up in the hood, or I'm the fat guy, mm -hmm. and then the sitcom guys would be like, "We got a show." Yeah, you know, you right. had like a theme back then. Mm -hmm. You know, and I think you saw they wanted your set to have that. Like, please have like yes. a through line. Yes, yeah. exactly, exactly. Whereas now I feel like it's way more like, uh, "What do you have to say?" I know. It's I like, know. <laughs> which is like, damn, I'd rather it be like, "Hey, what's, what's your family life like? Yeah. Like, hey, what's your point of view?" Oh, it's like, oh yeah. What's uh, your cause? Oh you know? god, oh, activism ruined comedy for uh, a while. I would hate yeah. that. I remember having my first com like meetings with Comedy Central. So we had a sketch show that we would do. And it, you know, on on Instagram, and it, you know, it was it was funny. We enjoyed doing it, and I would pitch that to I pitched that to Comedy Central, and they were like, "This is cool, but like, what about your perspective and who you are?" <laughs> yeah, I and, and, and I remember thinking, like, if you want something from a brown perspective, and I am a brown guy, isn't what I make technically from the brown perspective? Why no. does why does it have to be about my family? Why can't I make a silly sketch show with my friends? They want the cartoon version, yeah, you know, like yeah. Segura. That he went to some audition. They were like, "We're looking for someone Hispanic." He goes, "I am Hispanic." They're like. We need like a racist beaner. You know? like, we, want you to, we want you to be what we think of Hispanic people. We want you riding in a low rider with a bandana yeah. on and well, you know jumping a border. It's exactly true. God, that's so funny. They do want they want the racist thing. Yeah, they really do. <laughs> they want the most racist thing. Okay, what do we got left? So here? there's first Rogan yeah. and Caroline's Broadway comedy. All right, so Rogan's 19. So I'll go with the first movie with The Rock. No, that's already 2016. So the two you have for oh. Kevin left are Let Me Explain Released and Major Car Crash. All right, I'll go Major Car Crash 19. Yep. Yeah, okay. it was. Mm -hmm. Then there you go. Yeah, and then wow. March. Madness competition. It was that like a one-on-one -on -one competition? That That's what that implies, one. Yeah, right? Yeah, one-on-one. -on -one. You do a minute each, then you do two minutes each. Oh like my after God. that round is okay. gone, then you do five minutes, then you do ten, and then you do fifteen. Is the is one-on-one? -on -one. It was me versus Chris D. Chris Stefano. Oh wow, wow. That was a tough, tough fight. But everybody was like Michael Che, Dan Soder, Joe Liss. It was like they're a all lot in of this, the, this one that you did. Yeah, one. yeah. Wow. So you have to go up against your friends. I had one where I went up against a woman who had those like. Uh, Crutch arm things. Oh, right, right. So, oh, 2013, you got right under the diversity line. Yeah. You got yeah. right <laughs> under the line where they needed that to, should they need her to win. The only way I won that, because, you know, she's got the vote, obviously. Right. Just white guy versus handicapped lady. Mm -hmm. So she went up and she's like, Diet Coke is weird. Da -da, and, you know, got a laugh. And then I go, folks, what can I do here? And that killed so hard. <laughs> <laughs> I, <beat> her. <laughs> yeah. I was just leveling with him. I was like, I got, I can't. No joke of mine about Uber is gonna beat this handicapped lady. So that was it. Well, you won the game, bro. Yes, yes. yes. Well, uh, you're right. fucking. Thank you, Kevin Hart. You're the N word now. You're Appreciate all the things. It. Yeah, dude. You're all the things. All I feel like saying. you helped me with this. Was like uh, having a retarded kid drive a fake steering wheel. You know? I was like, hey, yeah, I'm driving. Yeah, yeah. We weren't expecting you to not get yours. That yeah, yeah. Not, not knowing careful. that was released was all crazy. Right, right. This is what you win, brother. This is a certificate, oh, certificate oh, wow. of completion. Oh, of, you get to, of being Kevin Hart. You so. guys are great. Yeah, there's final. There's, if anyone asks, there's documentation. There's proof. All right. Thanks. You know, I do Segura, huge podcast. You don't get anything. <laughs> Here we're in the basement. <laughs> yeah. right. This is nice. Of course, dude. Can we, Thanks. Have, we right before we let you go? Asan had uh, a comedy question just to, that we were just curious. We could sure. Mind. Just ask you before you go. Is yeah. Right? Yeah. So, you know, we were thinking. I just want to get your opinion on like. And I kind of heard you joke about it a little bit. I'm going to find it right here. But, like, what do you think, like, this AI is going to do for comedy? Is mm. this something that's going to help us or hurt us? Yes. I think you got to use it. Like, ChatGPT is very good for comedy. Because mm -hmm. you go, really? like, oh, I'm, I'm trying to compare shoes and and my grandma. And you go, what do, what do shoes and grandmas have in common? It'll just pump out a list. So you can use it to, like, come up with bit help. Have you, you, know? have you you've done it? I've done it. I don't wow. I don't have Chat GBT, but every time I'm with someone who does, I'm like, let me try something. Because I'm working on like a school shooter slash WNBA joke. Mm -hmm. What does school shooter and WNBA have in common? You know, both wow. make people sad. Wow. Or whatever. <laughs> but 
you know, uh, I wouldn't want that. I wouldn't shocked. Yeah. 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 I wouldn't want to witness either one. Yeah, yeah. 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 exactly. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. 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 Both more numbers from men. Yeah. You know? um, <laughs> sorry, Val. All right. um, but, uh, so that way it's good. And another way it'll help us is it can't go dirty. Like you try to get ChatGPT to go racial or gay mm -hmm. or trans jokes, they won't touch it. Right. So we can still own that. They, they won't go offensive because they're too scared to be like, you know, unprogressive. Whoa. So they won't do a trans joke. So we can just be the people who write those. But the problem is it keeps getting better and better. Like you can put in tell a Mark Norman style joke and it actually will. And it's like well, not a great joke, but it kind of gets some of the essence of you. And that scares me. Yeah, I like, actually did that, oh, and I yeah. wanted to know if you would read. It's just a cup. Cu uh, I, I wrote just write a joke about cars in the style of Mark Norman. Okay, and I'm curious to see what that sounds and like I don't when know, you I'm say. Curious it. If I'm gonna, if I'm gonna be like, oh shit, I like it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. uh, you ever notice how cars are like relationships? You start with that new car smell, everything's shiny, and you're driving around like a rock star. But give it a few years, and suddenly. You're arguing about <laughs> whose turn it is to fill up the tank, <laughs> and there's that weird noise that just won't go away. <laughs> <laughs> just like relationships, sometimes you took you look at your car and think, maybe I should trade for a newer model. Then you remember the hefty down payment, and you realize you're stuck in a long-term lease with your four-wheeled partner in crime. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't sound like you. But yeah. hey, at least uh, with a car, you can upgrade the GPS without getting into a heated debate about directions. <laughs> All right. So there is joke writing in there. Right. Yeah. Uh, it's not great yet. That's not super funny, but like, no. It, it's going to get better. Give it five more years. Right. And yeah. it, I would say there was there was probably like one or two lines that are that you really said in your voice. I was like, oh, that kind of it kind of nailed that. I did hear, I hear it. it. I, yeah, I heard it. it. It wasn't like all the way like, oh, well, Which there was a line that again? you made us all laugh. Or it was right. like, damn, that does kind of. Well, uh, no, 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 nothing no, to say, what but you just mean. like, oh, why? It got, it, it's it. At least tapped into Mark Norman. Yeah, yes, because yes. I'm form of Mark exactly. Norman. You know? Exactly. I saw it in your face too. You're like, oh, I can sell this. Yeah. You went from yeah. reading it to being like, I can sell this line. Right, right. Whereas I think if it's, it had been it, like it, a joke that, for Chappelle, it wouldn't have been the same. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's that there's a weird noise that just won't go away. Right. That line that was line. like, that's very. The way that's, you said yeah. it. The way you said it was like, that was you. But I don't even know if I get it, but I still. I can still try to say it like me. Yes. Like, like, what is that? No one, no one's ever like, oh, this relationship sucks. This is a weird, weird noise. <laughs> that won't go away. Like, no one's ever said that. So it's not, see, it's not a great A to B. Yeah. No, no, it's no, not. No. It was A to D. I, in my mind, I was like, oh, okay, I guess she talks too much. That's the that's the sort oh, of angle that I think the chat GPT went for there. That makes sense. That kind of is yeah. like, yeah, that's the only thing I could think of. See, I would go check engine light. Because just like a woman, you're like, I have, I know you're mad, but I don't know why. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. See? And that's why you'll never win, fucking robots. Yeah. <laughs> I do think though, what you said when they do start cussing, when the when the robots like, you know, bro, this nigga, you know, this bitch got a fat. <laughs> yeah. When the robots like, this bitch got a fat pussy. Yeah, yeah. it's a problem. It's over. That's a problem. That's a problem. <laughs> I'm laughing for real. Exactly. Exactly. The computer told you had a fat pussy. That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh man, Mark, thanks for coming. Thank on. you for doing hey, this. Thank you. This is a blast. Thank <laughs> you for having me. Seriously, thank you so much. You're the best. Thank you guys so much. Uh, go see him everywhere. He's Mark Norman. <laughs> He's got a big dick. Wait, I'm Kevin Hart. He's Kevin oh! Hart.